Warren Baxter Earp, 1855 to 1900. He died right here the way it was. Yep. He got shot. He got shot 20 years after Tombstone's incident. And when Wyatt Earp and them found out about Warren getting shot over here, well, they boarded a train and came back here. And they went after this man right here and shot him. I forget the name, his name, you have to look it up. Anyway, there you go. Some of these tombs, some of these markers are pretty hard to see. It's like the original markers and stuff. But I'm going to go in them hills over there just, just a minute. But anyway, there you go. There's where Warren Earp is resting. Yeah. 20 years after Tombstone's incident. He got in a... There was some rowdy guy. They, Warren and them always got in a mix. Always got in fights. And they didn't have any guns. They were told to turn their guns into that hotel that was next to the place where Warren got shot. But Warren went over there one day and got his pistol and came back to that saloon there that I showed you in the corner there, which is now a wine tasting. They sell wine, a really nice lady that works in there. That was it, I guess, and she works in there. And uh, that's where Warren was shot, point blank. He laid on the floor for a while. And uh, it was pretty hot inside there, so they had to bury him pretty quickly because his body laid there on that saloon floor for a while. And uh, they buried him here since it's so close to town. Yeah, town's just right over there, down there a bit. And, uh, yep. The guy walked in there and says, Where's Earp? Where's Warren Earp at? He wasn't here. And then I guess he walked in the side door or whatever and uh, or out of the used to be a cafe restaurant right next to the that's a big built used to be a big building. And uh he got shot. Okay, well that's the way it was back then. All right, <laughs> it's going on today too in different places of the United States, but you know, this is stuff that makes history. People are getting shot every day in the streets of America and they don't make history. But this was a growing place out here in the West, so that's why it made history. Ah. It's good for reading. Anyway, I'm gonna get back out there to the motorhome. Catch you all later. Yeah, look it up. Look it up. Look it up. The old frontier cemetery over here. Wilcox. 